printing with the TPU filament is very difficult. They told me it would be difficult. Um, and it was mildly difficult at the beginning, but then it got a lot better. Uh, but then it got worse, and then I cranked the spring down all the way until uh, it ran off the end of the screw. Um, and then it started printing great at that point. Well, well, it was stuck, but I didn't know that the spring had run off the end of the screw, so when I printed a different filament, I had to, it got stuck in there. I had to replace it. In any case, I have the new screws now, uh, new springs, and I have it cranked really tough. The, uh, the extruder screw is cranked real stiff, but I'm still getting sponge. These are sponge. These are totally not what it's supposed to be like. Actually, this is a, uh, it's a hair there, but this is a 60 TPU, 60A shore hardness, and this is really like foam rubber. This stuff is super stretchy. Um, would be fun if I could get it to print right. But this is my 70 TPU stuff that I printed the other shells out of. The, like the shell that's actually working right now. This shell. And um, it's frustrating because while well, it's looking like this, and this is where halfway through the print I really cranked down the screw um, and it started printing a little more like that on the top but then like one or two prints or the next couple of prints came out you know looking like this again even after the uh, screw had been cranked pretty tough uh, in any case uh, it's frustrating because I had been printing like this it was looking like this. This is the same filament. Super stretchy. Uh, granted the um, this part, but I don't I don't use that overhang. Um, I just use supports, and uh, this is you know. But it looks like glass, kind of. I mean, or a Fresnel lens, compared to these SpongeBob square blocks at the. Um, you know, these um, uh, XYZ cubes. But I finally did just crank it beyond as much as I could, and, or nearly. I might be able to crank it a little more, but I just got this. So this is almost, it's almost back to the quality of this. This, but we will see. I'm going to tweak it a little more and see if I can just because I, you know, it'd be cool if I could just get it like super, super nice looking. Like if I could get it like these edges, but all the time, you know, everywhere. If I could get it like that everywhere, that'd be awesome. It's probably not going to happen because of this bizarre shape. <laughs> 